Sumter Today is presented by USC Sumter, Sumter Tourism, and Prisma Health. I'm grateful for something for sure. You know, when I was, you know, I'm originally a Charleston native, and you know, when I came down here to go to school, just kind of kept me locked in, and it kind of kept me from my home, and just let me stay locked in on basketball. So, you know, I, I appreciate it. You know, just me coming back here and just seeing everything makes me want to grind even harder. You know, because it's once upon a time I wasn't a, playing overseas. You know, I had situations going on. And, you know, but I just stayed locked in through the whole process. You know, when I transferred out here to uh, something, you know, I came ineligible and stuff. So I was fighting through that. And finally, when I was able to get back on the court, you know, it was Kobe year, so we didn't have a season. So I jumped right in the semi pro and just took off from there. It was like basically my second home. Um, I played semi pro here. And, you know, ever since then, you know, everything has been going great. First season in Mexico went well, played great. Uh, went back to Mexico. Uh, after my uh, second year and played in Chiapas, did well uh, for, and finished second in uh, scoring, you know, uh, in that league. So that was a pretty good experience. And after that, I went straight to uh, Jamaica and played in the top league. Like, everybody can really play. Like you, if you, you know, there's always also, there's always someone out there, you know, working harder than you. You know, it's you know, everybody journey is different though. You know, everybody don't take the same path, you know, to get try to get to the same goals. It's gonna be hard for others, it's gonna be easy for others. It's about how you go about it. You know, you gotta invest in yourself and you gotta make ways, you gotta, you know, you gotta build relationships, you gotta have good people skills. Like it's a it's, it's a lot of leadership skills you have to have to obtain this goal, become a professional athlete and whether it is NBA, whether it's G League, TBL, overseas, whatever it is, you know, it's a grind to get there. Like my journey was a grind. It was a grind. Like I had all types of things I was stopping me from getting where I need to be. But actually, I'm grateful for those times because it actually made me who I am today. It's about the journey. Um, you know, like I said, it's, it's going to be harder. It's going to be easy for others. You know, it's about how you go about it. A lot of gimmicks to come with it. Like you're going to run into scams. You're going to run into you know agents that are just trying to get your get you get you get your money and then get you on through. You got some people, some agents that are sending you to different places. You you know what I'm saying they'll paint a picture for you and it'll be something totally different. I went through all that. I went through the cold showers and I went through all that stuff and grinded my way out. You know and I ended up on an island in Jamaica. You know what I'm saying like playing with all the guys who played in the top leagues and you know and it was you know and that right there kind of you know blew me up and took me over the edge and all these different places that's credible they're hitting me up and talking to me you know and now I got PK Cherry you know the NBA um, trainer over there is trying to work out some really opportunities for me so I appreciate him as well because he's been in my corner he actually helped me PK Cherry actually helped me got the offer in Jamaica I never met this guy ever but he saw my work ethic saw me on social media because I marked myself well saw I had game and was able to get me the contract in Jamaica Guys in college, you guys want to play professional. Just, um, just continue to grind. Just stay locked in. You get what you put in, and if you're serious about it, you'll go there. Somebody's gonna look at you, even if a coach don't sign you. Another coach knows another coach. That's where you can get a start and work yourself up. You gotta realize that it's about resume. You know, you know, you're gonna come in this game. You're gonna go through struggles. The best of them do. The guys in the NBA go through stuff. So, you know, you gotta just know how to move.